Hi everyone, we're back with another episode of the show. And today is a very special episode. You say that every week. <laughs> Rap for us. <laughs> this week it's special because you're going if to- If you had one shot. You guys are ruining the intro. One opportunity oh my gosh. to seize Stop. everything you Stop. ever wanted. So, we have a very special guest, which we will get to in a second. Which you can't see right now because it's only looking at me. And me. Is that why you draw this Shut out? Because it's up. only on you. Gosh. <laughs> he loves to be the center of attention. I'm the intro. <laughs> well. Okay. So today we have an episode of the show with one of one of the most talented mm. country musicians that I know <laughs> personally, personally <laughs> and who has been to my house and multiple times and met my wife. Also, it's not Shania Twain. Sorry. Because I do know her, but she hasn't met my wife. Yeah. No. And in today's She's very not French Canadian. That doesn't impress her much. <laughs> and in today's very special. <laughs> Roll the tape. Roll it. <laughs> today's very special episode, we're going to be Bradley banning everyone. <laughs> The intro. Yeah! I had planned, I don't know. Now we just quietly <laughs> listen to the intro. If you guys can hear us while the music's playing, we can find us fly. Because a lot of times we do it. Yeah, we can just sing along to it, even though what? Wait, is it live? Normally I have to die. To it, but and I really have to die. We'll see. Yeah, flipped off. Yeah! Alright, welcome back, everybody. Back. <laughs> We're here with weird. Bradley Banning. How are you, Yo, doing, Bradley? Good. It's been a while. Do you know what episode I was, the last time you've been on? What episode number it was? No, I know it was with A Lob. Like and, it was oh, with A Lob. That, that yeah, was still it was your me. house. Oh, and this, so this is your first like. Yeah, it was. Legit, well, mm -hmm. in yeah, in the dining room. We've in the studio, so you're legit like yeah. on the show episode. It was like two years ago. Johnny wouldn't quit like laughing. Oh, and Johnny, you notice That's he's Johnny. not here anymore. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Yeah. You laugh too much. We don't ever uh, laugh. Mm -mm. So what have you been up to, man? We're professional. <laughs> How you been? I'm good. I got married two Woo! months ago. That's such good news. Yeah. yeah. Your energy is very high. Yes. Yeah, a marriage. Did you turn off your notifications? <laughs> I'm very popular right now. Gosh. Oh my gosh. That's inappropriate. This. Or it's it's no, what's the right word? Impolite. Impolite. Will you flash the ring to your to oh, yeah. the cameras? Oh! Wow, look at that ring. Look at that ring. You got That's that new nice. ring. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's you fresh. got that new new. Yeah, my I got wife the... lost hers. Oh, really? Uh oh. Yeah. Did y'all have it that's, insured? It's really sad. No, that would have yeah. been smart. Do you have yours insured? How, Not yet. We talked how, about how it. Many, how many? How long ago did she lose it? Uh, actually, not that. May, a couple months ago. No. Oh, wow. oh no. But you can't insure the nostalgia around, <laughs> the <laughs> or like the sentimentality. That's true. Like you could replace the ring. Yeah, yeah. Right. It's been places. It, mm -hmm. Yeah. It it will never be the one that you proposed to her with. Exactly. Ooh, we think sad. one of our Airbnb guests <gasps> stole it. Mm. Oh, it's what? That's it's up. very sad. Yeah. Wait, well, you have an Airbnb? Well, <laughs> you should you should plug that. Now like, that we're in this studio. It's been a long time <laughs> well, since Bradley's been here. Bradley, when I quit the Paris job, I didn't really have a plan. We needed money. So we were doing anything possible to make money and awesome. we rented out our house on Airbnb. Including some illegal things. No, we didn't do illegal Remember, things. You did that one time. Hey, ask me if I can tell no, you. No, he's wearing ask this you now. If I can, ask me if I can tell you about the illegal things I've done. Hey, can you can you tell us about the illegal things you've done? Can't talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> Signed an NDA. Signed an NDA. Oh my god! Um, the, all right, Eminem. <laughs> uh, anyways, we found some stuff NDA. like stole. Well, we found that missing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing about thieves that. I've, <laughs> you know, a lot these. of them. My well, no, no, no. I've been thieved <laughs> often. You've been oh. thieved. A few times. Really? And the thing you don't realize about being thieved is that the psychological, like what oh. they have going to their advantage is you can't always miss something <laughs> that's not there. You know what I'm saying? No. No. So, like, <laughs> one more time. When someone gets murdered, you like mm -hmm. find like, oh, there's a murdered and person. And it's a stop and end oh, right. that but happens. A good thief will steal things that they it's know not that, obvious. that they know you're not gonna notice until it's too late to even <gasps> right. take action. Yep. So what did they steal from you? What's the so weirdest thing? The ring, um, remember that there was a camera oh, yeah, in the middle the of youth group. We were in this massive oh, auditorium no. in the gym 
hundred and something kids. Yeah. And I had a I had a camera on a tripod, like a big I mean like this. Yeah. It was exactly <laughs> like this. And it's near the soundboard where all this equipment is and every, and then I kind of moved it to another side of or something. I like touched it once, moved it, and then and then somehow lost track of it in a big open room. And the psychological effect is you're just thinking, oh, I must have I just misplaced, misplaced it. Yeah. And so the like thief gets away every... because you're just like thieves. Yeah. You think it was a kid though? Well, I don't know. I mean, it could have been. I think it was, and I think they didn't think a thing about it. Maybe it was a core member. Oh. Didn't someone steal a guitar from Nick? So then, what? no, from me. Oh, from you. Okay. What? So many thievery. Similar yeah. thing. It was not that long. A after bunch that, of stuff right? in the youth center, and a window was broken in. But again, they didn't steal everything. It's just like the window was broken in. So you're like, was what it was hail in here? Or something? Or like, I, I just hadn't messed with the guitar in a while. So I'm like, what was stolen out of here? And then mm -hmm. you're like, was this thing stolen? I don't, did oh, someone yeah. have, and then a few weeks later, you're like, no, 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 I'm pretty sure my yeah. guitar. But then yeah. by that point, it's like too late. It's all gone. That happened to me. I got my car broken into, like mm -hmm. they broke the window and stole a backpack. And there was a notebook in the backpack. So it wasn't that big of a deal. Um, and it wasn't until later that I've been thinking about what could have been in the backpack that I realized that my great grandmother's rosary was in there. Oh. Thought you were gonna say ashes? Oh. No. <laughs> Going on the theme. Um, Going on but the theme. it's like my great grandmother was the mother of nine children. Oh. My grandmother was the young youngest of the nine, and I'm you know one of eight grandkids of hers. So mm. like out of a huge family, I somehow ended up with this rosary. Oh. And then it got stolen and I, I like lost my mind. There's one so time upset. in our car we got um, our stereo got ripped out. And the thing is, though, inside was a Hillsong CD, which is oh. a worship there CD. You go. So <laughs> when they put it in, yeah. Jesus music gets blasted so, out at them. That's um, awesome. I had also in that, same, in that same backpack, I had a Bible that I had had since college with yep. all these notes. Oh, and that was like, that, that was also hurts. really hard. Cause like, Don't you think though, listening to Hillsong though, it would just encourage them? Like you're in a dark, more? you're in a dark moment, but you're forgivable. <laughs> oh, like, no, 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 no. It was, it was probably like you sinner come back to Jesus. Well, it was something like the that. Repentant I have a feeling. Yes. Could return all the, the yeah, stuff he's yeah. stolen. You are a, yeah, you're a yeah. sinner. Like, yeah. Dirty, gee, I still love sinner. you, but you're a thief. Yeah. Return all this stuff. Return water there flowing. Are many, you know? Okay, don't you think everyone should know that who's listening that Allie has had a few drinks today? One. I have one. Oh, that's <laughs> one not, margarita. I Just tell, because one, it's one like margarita. margarita. It margarita. 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 No, this is so if Ali slurs her words, you know why she's singing thieving. about thieves. Riley, what's the worst crime that's been committed against you that you're free to say? <laughs> that you're free to say? I don't know. I can't that think of anything. you haven't signed an NDA that you I can't think, talk about. I think thievery yeah. is probably yeah. the most serious crime that's it, been committed it, it against me. It is a very personal, like, violation because then it's a psychological game too of like what if they stole a key to your house have you ever been and they can and they can break in oh i'm serious and then they yeah. can break in at any I time feel like, i feel like i'm gonna get something stolen tomorrow probably. oh my gosh you know, like, tomorrow we're talking about this i'm like, it's like yeah exactly the hierarchy of crimes <laughs> thievery is probably yeah. the most serious I mean, such a violation. Oh, okay. you cheated on I feel no. like that's pretty bad. But Ooh. not legally. Yeah, that's no fun. Like, well, what's the yeah, legal it's not ramifications yeah. for cheating? Yeah. But it's just wrong. <laughs> I'm thinking 10 commandments, you know? Moral compass. I, I mean, I guess. I don't know that I've ever, maybe like forging documents. Would that be oh, worse I've than. Oh, I've definitely done that. Would that be worse I did that in like middle school. Thievery? I used to sign people's mom's signatures on notes oh, to get them out of class all the that time. Kid, huh? I did my mom's signature. I did lots Ooh, of moms. What is the worst crime you've ever done? Oh, Adrian's done a lot of hate crimes. <laughs> I was so afraid. Y'all, I was having this conversation the other day. I was telling a friend of mine, I was like, I never did anything bad growing up, and I really regret it. Like, me too. Oh, me <laughs> you feel oh, like you man. missed out? I, I was. I was like, why was I so afraid of being sent to the principal's oh office? Oh, my gosh. Or yes. like, I oh, had to write my name follower? on the board in first grade. Yeah. Oh. Scarred me. Oh. I didn't ever Charles, get written up again. You're a rule follower. So, Bradley, your message, yeah. your message to young kids is to be bolder and make And make mistakes. Do, that's, that's a bad <laughs> thing. <laughs> No, really? I think get out there and do yeah. bad stuff. Or else you'll regret it when you're no, 29. <laughs> yeah, that put me in a bad spot. <laughs> yeah. No, it's like the Martin Luther. Doesn't Martin Luther have like a sin boldly or something? It's like if you're going to sin, was, sin boldly or something. I think that was St. Augustine. Or maybe it was Raymond or, Arroyo. 
Martin Luther said that? I don't think, think it was Martin Luther. Maybe it was Martin Luther King Jr. No, I think maybe Ignatius. <laughs> I feel like it's not maybe a Na- no, Ignatius kind of like thing. A, like it's not a, Martin Luther. I know what you're talking about, though. But it's not mm. Martin Luther. How do you know I what I'm know. talking about if you don't know what it is? Because if you're going to sin, sin boldly. Are you going to take your hood off at all? That's the thing. Okay. Do you want to explain your hood? I'll take it off. Well, do you want to... Oh, here you go. Why they make you laugh so hard? So bad. What's wrong? I with wish it? you could that see yourself great. right now. I don't want to see myself. Uh, yeah, exactly. Um, okay. If you could go back to high school, like, what is something that Ooh. would not get you arrested, but that you would definitely? What are some of those things that you wish you would have done? Like you know, the senior the senior pranks. <gasps> okay. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Me too. You know what the best senior prank I've ever heard of is uh, this school in like Nebraska or something. Yeah, you can. Um, they took pigs and put they had four pigs and they put them in the school or maybe it was cows and they put them in the school that's a big difference, that is a huge difference. <laughs> okay, i think it was cows because cows can go upstairs but not down uh, and so they like ha- they took four oh, cows yeah. <laughs> yes and they cow? Sp- <laughs> spray- didn't think that's that right they spray that's painted rude. on the side of the cows one, two, three, and five, and they put them in the upstairs of the school. <gasps> no, that's and so genius. then they're looking for the fourth cow that's pretty half that's, the day, that and you can't really get them to funny. go down the stairs. That's that mental, like it's a crime that has a mental. Yeah, angle. yeah. I like those. It's a psychological yeah. crime. Like, like thievery. I like those. A it's like a thriller. A thriller. <laughs> like thievery for for sure. Yeah, yeah. Wait. So you do more senior pranks? I don't know what I do. I just wouldn't be. I'd, I was so afraid. I, I want to not be afraid. Mm. You know, like to afraid to mess afraid. up. I don't yeah. think I'd go do something bad, but no. I'd be like, not I, afraid. don't worry yeah. as much, of the consequences. Know? Yeah, yeah. I used you to prank do a it bunch up about stuff. Yeah, we know. Your like wife? No, don't ask. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I wouldn't know. <laughs> I used to do a bunch of bad stuff. <laughs> okay, like I what? Don't once. ask her what. <gasps> Why, really? Yeah. Pretty. What was that for? Can I ask that? Yeah. That one I think is okay. It was like eighth grade. Um, I was like writing notes back and forth with this girl and they were like really bad about the principal and uh, not like about killing him or anything. Cause that would be like <laughs> that's really good. aggressive. Yeah. But they were just like me. It was almost like a burn book about people. It was just Ooh, really mean. But you just, and we just talked crap about a lot of people and wrote a lot of bad words. And mm. so we got, I, I know this is such an old person thing to say, but I am glad that there wasn't like social media wasn't around. Sure. As much. Oh my goodness. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Yes. I'd be definitely canceled. Yeah. yeah. There's one VHS te- tape from a history project that yeah. we're not going to talk about that I have from mm-hmm. that it was pretty bad. Yeah. I'm looking back on it, I'll tell you afterwards. We used looking to, back on it now, that was pretty bad. We my my friends in high school, I don't know why, but we were obsessed with like being naked in public. Oh my god. What? That yeah. is a very yeah. specific yeah. interest. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Is- yeah. We used to streak on the right. football field. Like during games or no, like at no, night no. when like, nobody's there. Like at night when no one's like there. Midnight? It's stupid. Oh. But we would like go to the football field, like the old stadium that uh was at the middle school, and we would just like literally run around on the field and take our clothes off. Now do you think there was like a good urge to, there? Like was there like a desire it, for the Garden of Eden that was like Yeah, I definitely think it was free, like really spiritual and unshackled. So. Was there like to like a song or like you just Probably. to just ran? Yeah, it's kinda weird what to be, high school did you go to? South Lake Carroll. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds right. It's kinda Ryan. weird to be <laughs> I didn't do ecstasy like a lot of my classmates. Oh, good. So. good. But it is, it is a little yeah. strange to be with just like how many other friends? Like handful. To be with a handful of friends on a football field. Silent. I mean, there's no. I mean, like, we like, there's probably and there's probably ah! background song. And yeah. you're just standing naked like, in an open I, field. I have skinny ah! dipped in the yeah. fountain in Town Square. Oh, that's great. In Italy. South Lake. The Trevi Fountain. I thought you were going to say that. No, Fountain. that would be cool. That would be really Wait, in South Lake Town Square, you yeah. you swam in there naked? Yeah. Naked. What's the statue of limitation? With the statue of limitation? I, I hope no one from South Lake PD is watching this right I now. I hope that they are. We're going to get her. <laughs> That's what they're saying. They're so, Bradley, have you, been, have you gone back to concerting? Oh. Yeah, well, yeah, I'm playing all the time right now. people know who you are and what you do. Maybe not. Yeah, you're famous. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think. That was from the like, man who needs no introduction. That was from like season one. Yeah. You do. So maybe How many seasons a, do y'all have now? I don't know. I just think of it as like dining room table and then or dining room. We have over 100 episodes we do. now. We're, this is like episode one. That's like at something. least but this is like five new, seasons. Yeah, it's yeah. like new studio seasons, you know? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm. So studio why don't you tell the good people? Because there's a lot of new people here. We mm. do have why a lot don't of you new tell, That's awesome. Tell yeah. the good people who you are and what you do. My name is Bradley Banning. And I was going to say, well, my, my last name is change. 
He's what, Mr. Bradley Banning now. Kyle. I am Mr. Bradley Banning. Oh, Bradley yeah. Kyle Banning. Bradley yeah. Kyle Banning, yeah. Mm-hmm. Named after a kid my parents babysat growing mm. up. Wow, yeah. oh, what an honor. Bear? No. Kyle O'Bear? No. Where is Kyle O'Bear? What's he doing these days? Uh, I think he's sick. Was he sick? I don't know. He tells Kyle's sick? That he wasn't probably coming. faking it. Oh, okay. Kyle's faking it. Yeah. Um, country musician. Country musician. I like country music. I write country music. You can find it. Search me. Has, has my name Banning flash up there? Gone back Bradley much? Banning. Oh, yeah. Like, I'm playing 10 times, 12 times a month oh, right nice. now. Nice. Whoa. That's good. I played awesome. twice this weekend, played three times the last two weekends. And so, playing a lot. Come yeah. see me. Did yeah. Cool. Did Full band, trio, and acoustic stuff. Just, it's wild. It is it different like, now after COVID? It really is, yeah. In what way? I don't know. Like, it just feels different. I don't know if. Is it, I, I don't know. People are. Normal normal again? Yeah. It's starting to feel normal, but there's still like tension because you know there's still people mm, are really yeah. afraid of masks and then they're or not afraid of masks, yeah. but yeah. they're afraid. Yeah. So they wear but masks. They, and yeah. I don't know. It's kind of weird. They Everybody's brought, trying to figure their budget stuff out. That's the really weird mm, thing, too. People you know? just shouting, like, do you have the vaccine? Yeah, <laughs> it's weird. And they Instead of free bird, they yeah. just say, vaccinate yourself. Yeah. It's just really, I don't know that's <laughs> On the stage. <laughs> yeah, it's just really weird timing. Uh, they brought holy water back to our parish <gasps> last week. What? Yeah. Yep. Wait, which was really weird. Ho- holy water oh, is we back. getting dirty. Who? Yep. Oh. St. Francis. I was thinking Leonard Skinner, and I was like, <laughs> what? <laughs> You know like, that song, Holy Water, bring it no, back? No, y'all, y'all said, what did you say? You said free bird. And then I was like, right. Leonard Skinner? Is, what? No, they brought, yeah, oh, sorry. We did too. They, they in the diocese or the parish, yeah. whatever, brought Holy Water back. Yeah. yeah. Did you use it? Yeah. Wait, did. No. where do you go? St. Francis. Oh, St. Francis. Sorry. Yeah. I missed that. I was singing yeah. Skinner. No, yeah. yeah. Still, Simple man. No, same. At our parish, t- yeah. It was but, really and they, But now they tell you. Or they they put out a notice that we're gonna switch it out once a week, and I'm like, what were you guys doing before? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they were just what was it I know, on there. MTV. And yeah, I was like, I don't know what the protocol. I can't have it in my mind that your dad would drink yeah. all the holy water at the when end of every. He was younger. He was an oh. altar boy. Yeah, he would I heard do that. that. Story. He that was, was a dedicated servant of the Lord. <laughs> In the church. <laughs> when Jesus tells you to drink all the holy water, you drink you, all of it. And the big, especially can you imagine the big bowl? And just, like this. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Is that holy water? Someone we had a pretty say. crazy week. We, I can only say so much about this project. Oh I want to know. Wait, what? <laughs> NDA. Riley, do you know what an NDA is? <laughs> I recently yes. learned. I, I thought you said NBA. <laughs> but I know also, that is, too. He doesn't have that. that. I'm not in that. But <laughs> I'm not in that. I've learned recently about... Uh, non-disclosure agreements mm. <laughs> and how we have they a sack are. of them by the front door of the studio that yeah. people have to sign when yeah. they come so i'm not allowed to talk that's about how it. you know that you're but i can time. tell you that <laughs> for this ali's on the tiktok team that, that <laughs> the the definition of a professional something is mm-hmm. that you get paid to do it mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. which now i'm thinking like what are all the things that i'm a professional yeah of speaker um professional speaker professional podcaster professional podcast you're getting paid to do this? your professional musician we get paid for Are this? Paid Are for we getting paid for this? <laughs> I mean, in the royal we, like, <laughs> wow. the studio Haven't gets patronage. It. Uh, we're getting gypped. Yeah, we're what getting else gypped. Am, I, am I a professional? Um, um, you're a professional, professional script writer. You're a professional cake cutter. Ooh, tell me more about that, script writer. He can't. Uh, ask me that's where it is, <laughs> right? Oh, nice. Can't talk about it. Can't talk about it. A professional really interviewer. A professional. Yes, a professional interviewer. Professional. TikToker. TikToker. Ooh. Professional yeah. so, homeowner. Wait, what? You, when you, you pay, pay when money, people to do pay. That. When people Airbnb. pay. Airbnb. No, in a your professional. House? A, prof- a professional hotel manager. <laughs> yes, that sounds better. Yes. No, a, a professional yep. bed and breakfast manager. There you go. Yes, yeah. but they cook their own breakfast and they make their own beds. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well. In our house. <laughs> yeah. Don't touch our underwear. <laughs> Please <laughs> steal our rings. That'd be so, so yeah. we one. How often do you have people stay there? Yeah. So when when I first <laughs> quit, it was it was, seemed like often, but it was like once or twice a month, mm. and it'd be like for a week or so. Oh wow! And so I'd sleep at the studio. Mm-hmm. I think I'm just gonna like Airbnb Dedicated. your house and just you like could. crash. Could. Yeah. Yeah. You could <laughs> just wreck shit. <laughs> <laughs> Come Take to something house. like a like a book or something. And leave the empty or, like, space when he weird wanders. Stuff. Play music Ooh, at like three a.m. Oh no! He, his wife organized their books in color order, Ooh. so you could like flip them. <gasps> 
and then we would know, and then be like a mental game, like yeah, color like, order. I really? Yeah. Is that look. for fun or because like OCD tendencies? She <laughs> does look okay. really good. You want to know it the is, real story? Is, is really I do. Beautiful. I want to no, know this. The real reason is that you're colorblind. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> I okay in a relationship, Bradley. <laughs> Since you're asking for relationship now that advice, you're married, I am. Married. Yeah, tell me you've got yeah. more experience than I. Have. I know. I know people hate it when you give unsolicited marriage advice, but no, go for but it. I'm gonna so, it. in a relationship, there's two people, right? And so that means that one person is <laughs> all. <laughs> it's 2021. <laughs> oh, I was thinking people who marry Unless themselves. Unless you live in Utah. Oh. So self coupled. That means that one person is always more X than the other. So like mm. one person is oh. more frugal than the other, or right. one person is more tidy. Now. In the general population, you might not be a tidy person, but just compared to your oh, spouse, yeah, you are. Mm -hmm. You are. This is like, like the bummer and Lazarus thing. Your spouse yeah. is like you're so tidy, but like in, with all your friends, you might be the messiest person. Right. But if you're tidier than your spouse, you're the tidy. Like yeah. your spouse is like, gosh, you're so yeah. tidy, and all of your friends are like, gosh, you're so messy. And you're like, that you should sense. see my wife. Yeah, <laughs> she's real oh. a slot monster. <laughs> and then. <laughs> <laughs> Can you put that on a t-shirt? She's my a slob wife. monster. My real wife is a real slob monster. Slob, I meant to say slob monster, but that's kind of... <laughs> so anyway, weird. so... New merch. I get... <laughs> I get a little anxious. Like, m when I get stressed, I want everything to be organized. Not necessarily, Ooh, not necessarily clean, but like... Mm -hmm put away same yeah 100%. and danielle really internalizes that she can exp she experiences when i'm like i start like organizing stuff and throwing it around and she well, like knows scary. that i'm just... yeah she knows that i'm stressed and like do you do it with the hood on she feels that yes. okay i put a hood on CD. yeah mm -hmm. i put yeah. a i put a sweater Blast on m and m i put a sweater on i only mm -hmm. wear boxers mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's and how have, she knows this is for real and i put on rain boots oh, oh. yeah the and then I just started. I awesome. seen That's like marriage. That at your house. Yeah. So I was, mm -hmm. I was like, I was pretty stressed, and so she <laughs> what? Didn't even have rain boots on this time. Not. <laughs> no. Nope. Didn't even. Bare. That's footed. how. That's how stressed he was. Uh huh. And my wife was being a very good wife, and she was trying to do something to like kind. make me feel better. And I had to stay up late working, so I was in the living room working, and she was like, she just started organizing the books, and I'm like, what? Like, and then after like an hour. All the books so were in pleasing. color order. And she was like, look, I did this. Oh, so Danielle. Sweet. Isn't this great? That's amazing. That is really sweet. So it was kind of like sweet. a, so now every time I look at it, I feel like a horrible husband. Oh. oh. <laughs> so, well, guilt trip, huh? Yeah. Uh, then it works. It's like the bookshelf my wife just built while I was she working. Did, she <laughs> built a bookshelf for you? Well, she Okay, yeah, I said built. She put it together. But it was like. <laughs> An Ikea yeah. one? <laughs> no, no, it was like. A real bookshelf, but mm -hmm. it came in the mail and it wasn't Ikea. Yeah. But it had a bunch of shelves. And so I got home and she put it together and it's like six foot tall. And Aww. I was like, oh You're like, man, now. And now it's in my office. <laughs> and so I'm like, like, she built that. Are you I like, was not wait, there. So wow. Are you the husband now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Does that make me the wife? She books? proposed yeah. to me, basically. Whoa. Whoa. We want to hear that. Yeah. Yes, please tell <laughs> me. Did you know that? No, I didn't what? know that. Okay. I'll That's make it quick. Story. I want to talk. I don't want to talk about me. But no, that's why you're here. Yeah, please you're don't talk about, about your wife. Yeah. I want to <laughs> 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 sound bad. No, but no, we got engaged on the Feast of the Immaculate Conception, December 8th. Mm. So I prayed a novena. I was like letting go. I was like, God, whatever you want for us. Like I've prayed a million novenas before, like whatever you want. I'm, yeah. I surrender sure. myself to you. Mm -hmm. And we go to mass that morning. It's a Tuesday. And we're like, man, this is just like the best day ever. And like, I'm so happy. And I'm like, what's going on? I'm laughing during mass. And I go to, she's a high school youth minister. So I go to her office. She makes me coffee while I'm waiting for them to like de-COVID the um, oh, right. adoration chapel. Mm. So I have coffee. She goes, hey, you know, uh, our friend Tammy who works with her is like, Tammy was saying if we want to come in and like, you know, talk about engagement stuff and what it looks like. Cause we wanted to know like what it looks like getting married mm -hmm. in Catholic church. Yeah. You can come in. And she says that Tammy walks by mm. and she's like, Hey, mm -hmm. Joe, want to talk sometime? And I'm thinking we're both like, yeah, let's, let's set up something January, February. And she was like, I have time today. And we're like, okay. okay. And we're just thinking we're doing, yeah, yeah just yeah, yeah. talking yeah, about yeah. it. Yeah. Just give me the plan. She was yeah. like, you know what? Y'all yeah. go to adoration for a little bit. Come back. I'm leaving early today, but get back before this time and I'll be here. So we go to adoration and I'm just like laughing, cracking up so much so that she's, my wife is like, 
what are you doing? What is wrong with him? And she's asking God, what is wrong with him? And I'm just like, it's like I was seeing Jesus like laugh at me. He's like, look at these doors opening in your face. And I'm like, oh, this is amazing. It was just the best day ever. We go into Tammy's office after that, and she slaps this paper down in front of us. Who's your best man? Who's your maid of honor? Who's this, this? And we're like, huh? What? She's <laughs> like, we're going to have to do this at some point anyway. Just start filling out the information. Tammy's wow. a bold woman. Are you here for uh, on your own? Whatever. Volition. Yeah. 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 Free will. Free will. Yeah. Is this a valid like yeah. union? Yeah. And so... I'm like, okay. And we're kind of like looking at each other. So she says, yeah, y'all have done all the prep because we did a lot of marriage prep just from priests telling us, hey, sure. y'all should do this. Mm -hmm. And it uh, ended up, she goes, y'all can actually get married anytime after February. And we're like, huh? That's and you're she's like, we're like, really soon, Tammy. <laughs> we're like, so okay. <laughs> and so Kayla goes, well, I'm about to drop a bomb on you and Bradley. I've been praying a lot lately, and I really feel like Divine Mercy weekend would be an amazing weekend to get married, which was four months from then. Wow. And Tammy goes, let me see if it's open. And she calls the church, she calls Season Keller, and they're both like, yeah, it's open that weekend. Oh, and Kayla's gosh. like, let's do it. And I was like, yeah, let's do it. Oh, my god! But you weren't even engaged. No. <laughs> And so we did you have the, a ring? No. Oh, oh, we, I, wasn't, I thought it was going to be a Kayla. A week before that. <laughs> I'm going to yeah. tell someone. I'm going to be like, I just, this is what I'm supposed to this get married. Is, yeah. And I'm going to so, force it. No, no. Okay. You ask a guy, like, yeah. just come see the information. Yeah. Ali, yeah. Ali just, just, just book come. the church. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just exactly. like several days. So then if it goes, then I'll be like, okay, the next yeah. day, yeah. just all the feast days. We're just going to get some information in my life. Yeah. We're just going to get some information. Because the Lord knows. the best man? Yeah. Like, this is our third date. Like, who? Who? Yeah, maybe not with me. Just would you know who would it be? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's so wild. so then when did you buy a ring? Yeah. And then well, did you, like, no. So we he leave. still hasn't bought a ring. No, not at that point. No, I didn't. there's no ring. <laughs> no, we literally left her office. She goes, or left Tammy's office. She goes, so what do you think? And Kayla turns to me and says that. I'm like. I feel like you just like proposed to me. Yeah. And then <laughs> she basically mercy? did. She did. I did a full on proposal, okay, but okay, it was good. a month and a half later because. Two months I, But I, you had already wedding. started the process. Like you had yeah, I had already. to get the yeah. ring made. Oh, okay. And so mm -hmm. we got the Takes ring time. made yeah. and I actually proposed, the ring didn't show up. And so I got to propose with my grandmother's ring. Oh, that was actually, sweet. she inherited. And so mm. I wow. proposed with her, my grandmother's engagement ring. She got hers oh. the week after that, I think, and so sweet. Yeah, and then married Divine Mercy Sun. Divine was it a Saturday, Sun it Friday? It was the Friday, yeah. Friday that's of Divine awesome. Mercy. Wow. Yeah. So yeah. Cool. All right, Brittany. That's what we're gonna do on our next date. I don't really. No, no, no. no, no, no it, worked. <laughs> it worked. It worked. On our next worked. group date. It did work. It, it did. It worked. It worked. Our next group, group date. date. Well, we can't go out it alone. Okay. Right. <laughs> so our next group date. Oh, we're, we're just going gonna bring peacocking. Remember? Yes. Ali just heard that phrase. Told what is that? We should go peacocking. That Your means, therapist told you to go peacocking. Yes. Why? That means. Let me explain it. Yes. Basically, <laughs> no. You we like know what it get, means, but why no, does you know, therapist tell you? Do you know, know what that means? What does it mean? Do you, yes. you, okay. What does it mean? You peacock. What does that mean? He you get out there with know. your feathers and just kind of like you hey. like you like get yourself like you, you make yourself done up. Yeah. And you strut around up and down Main Street hoping that a man will be like swoop down in. You throw the handkerchief and you let it fall down. Whoever picks it up. And then you get the bend and snap. Yeah. It's it's a culmination of the old and the new. Didn't Why you is your therapist telling you to do this? I think that's good advice. Yeah, peacocking. I think so too. Get out there. She's basically okay, saying, okay. like, get, get out, out she's there. She's basically saying, <laughs> some dude's not going to walk into your house and ask you out. Yeah. I mean, that would okay. be pretty miraculous, and I pray for that. I just, that that I, would, I, just, <laughs> I just don't know that I would tell my daughter, like, that, get done up. Like, but, let's really get, like, But you're not her, and, like, her therapist. Get out there. Also, she's like, three. Like, get out on the yeah. street. No, like, she's not saying go to the get street. Get Wait, no. did you say get your outside. therapist is three? No, his no. daughter is three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you're not, no, no. She's basically saying, like, don't be afraid she's to, like, like, like to go okay. to events or and to go to, like, That's not what stuff. peacocking is. Peacocking no. is getting done up. No, 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 no. This is what we talked about. Because we talk about, like, not going gangster. Episode title. Episode title. 
Catholic peacocking. I like so you it. walk around with a divine mercy. No, you walk around with scapular. holy, yeah, ma- holy yeah. medals. You go to all the daily masses like at mo- every church. Every daily modest, yes. modest dress. Yes. But it's kind of sexy. Yeah. Like it's like yeah. it's like shapely. Yeah. Like it's, it's modest. Shape. Maybe with a little tennis. It's like, like a tennis shoe. What is that? Oh, like, like a tennis shoe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's like fun. But you like are signaling. Flirty. Flirty. <laughs> like you could pal- run fast. A pal campaign t shirt. So it's kind of trendy. Ooh, with like a floral skirt. But then you got the skirt. Yeah. Wait, so that's but like, but like Catholic not peacocking. a floor length skirt, just like a no. right below the knee. Or if it was floor length, it would be a fashionable one, not like just the box. Shapely, yeah, yeah. Sure. it would be yeah. shapely. Yeah, it's not like a Quaker. No, right. no, 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 no. It's, no. Like, it's, it's definitely shapely. not denim. It's shapely. Yeah. It's not yeah. a denim. No, full on. And so on. you're going to the parish cookout. No, yeah. we're going. Done we're up. thinking about like yeah. places like Harvest Hall. No, but Catholic peacocking would be. Oh, or, oh, yeah. Okay, a Catholic bookish fry. Catholic bookstore. Catholic book. Store like YCP. Oh, I it's hate YCP. It's just gonna be like boomers. <laughs> unless Sorry. you want to wait. Unless, unless you want to sponsor us YCP, because we are semi-Catholic podcast. So yeah. <laughs> unless you want to sponsor, and we're sponsors. semi-professional. And too. we're semi-professional. Wait. No, 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 you gotta you do your thing. Yeah, that's why I reached. I don't know. I forgot already. Yeah, we don't have the soundboard. Let's lift it up Speaking together. of of uh, sponsors, Brittany. No, Allie. Brittany's done a few. Oh. Allie, if you could do Studio Coffee. I always hey. have to sell Today's stuff. episode is brought to you by Studio Coffee. Hey, are you tired, you lazy bag of bones? <laughs> <laughs> Brittany, I swear to God, if you interrupt her ad read, you are fired from the podcast. <laughs> Let her get through one freaking joke without interrupting her. I know, but you were about to interrupt her. <laughs> no. I just want to head it off the pass. I was just She's laughing. Do the, I yeah. wasn't going to say anything. But I'm after so you laugh, you normally like, fill, let her. Because I'm so funny. Let's I just give her the floor. <laughs> Allie, this is you. <laughs> hey. How about See, just start over? Up. No. no. Okay. Ding. Hey, you lazy bag of bones. You want to wake up? <laughs> then you need this studio coffee. Now, let me tell you something. It is a medium roast. It is a blend of Central and South America beans. And ethically sourced. We, ethically sourced. We are helping families, right? Yeah. Maybe. 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 It could be. I said My family. Strong. <laughs> we are helping some families in the world. You are helping. So feel your creative soul and your weirdness by getting coffee. coffee. Who Where came can, up with that slogan? Shut up. <laughs> Where can people go, Allie? Drinkstudiocoffee.com. Boom. <laughs> we should have That's the bell. That's all it is, too. Where's the bell? Know? I'll go get the bell. We use it for the TikTok. Can, were you going to ask about, the, about the studio coffee, Bradley? Yeah, I was. Okay, Allie, why don't How's you want to smell it? I do. Oh, we, only have a couple, we only have a couple beans. Oh, it's not? We only have like a couple beans we get them, in there. How did we get it in there? Studio coffee, we partnered with Zelly Beans. Mm. It's a Catholic... <laughs> so, this is gonna be our sponsor, Bill. Oh my god! Ooh, I love your goggles. Um, your goggles are so hot so right now. It's a it's a per, it's a blend specifically for the studio. Isn't it? Isn't the, it the best smelling coffee you've ever smelled? It really is. Yeah. Really you want a whole bean? You, wanna, you <laughs> want a you want a grounded bean? You can get it ground, however. Grounded you want. bean? A uh, coarse ground? Coarse you want a coarse ground? Fine ground? ground. Fine Medium ground. fine. No. Yeah. Fine or coarse? Bra- fine or ground? Coarse. Fine. Ground. I like fine. Okay, fine. tell me why fine or, I, or coarse ground why. Uh, one's for espresso well, and one's for regular uh, drip coffee. Right, right, right uh, Adrian? Uh, sort of. Oh, we're sort of. Adrian, playing. unfortunately, doesn't have a microphone. Adrian, remind me to buy another microphone, too. No, we can't afford it. <laughs> <laughs> well, we so do only have four coffee. channels, so. Well, yeah, so true. we'd have to buy a whole new. Speaking new of affording. Adrian, remind me to buy another mixer. Do not. Adrian, don't write that down. Wait, speaking of being a. F- a Speaking of, you got Speaking it. of you got being it. able to afford She's things. Drunk. Oh. Um Are we going blast We really need our... your support. And you can support us monthly. Uh if you support us monthly for a hundred dollars a month, you can kiss Edmund on the lips. That's not <laughs> part of the That's a level. Nope, that's for not a level. For $250, you can have complete control over Brittany. <laughs> Britney's Catholic match account. Did it's you true. know that, Bradley? I did not. Two hundred fifty dollars a month. That's it. You can have complete mm. control. You, you decide pick her who I go fate. On dates you can with. go on dates with. The, I love you could, that. You could, you could DM. set up things. How many you dates have DM. you been on? Because of that? <clears throat> have you been on any yet? Well, no one's I've been done on the so many two hundred fifty level in yet. In general, <clears throat> how many through Catholic match? <laughs> Zero. One. <laughs> Was it good for me? No. <laughs> Well, it's because I'm not, not, he's not h- anymore in my life. I've so. been on a lot of hinge dates, way more hinge dates um, than Catholic What is match. hinge? Don't, you don't want to know. It's another Just app. Just be thankful you're married. Be thankful you're married. Bradley. It's hard out here for a Marriage life. pimp. Bradley and I are married. <laughs> Wait, so I have a question. So uh, you know how other. a lot of people think like, 
oh, when I get married, like my life will be great because I'll have this like other person and all it gets harder. That okay, that's what I was gonna ask you. Like you're <laughs> a, a few that's months good. in, right? Yeah. yeah. And so in what ways like that's, in what ways is it different from what you thought it would be? In what ways is it easier, harder, whatever? It's great. super fruitful. Well, if you're talking like spiritually, like the, the base thing is I feel like I mean, tell me how yours your experience has been, but I'm only a couple months in, but it's been very fruitful, but I didn't realize how attached to my way of life I was. Mm. Mm. And I did How many years were you single? Mm. 30 what? How old are you? <laughs> I'm 33, so, so 33 years single. Jesus's age. Yeah, it is the Jesus year, yeah. yeah. Jesus this year. I mean, you think the, you're going to get crucified this year? <laughs> I hope, I hope not. I I've hope thought not. about that a couple of times. I hope, I hope not. not. Just Golly. You just think, oh, yeah. I think y'all are throwing out stuff. I'm going to get something stolen from me. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> get Man, you're uh, not going to leave here feeling good. Sorry. Okay, so, so yeah, in what, in what ways is it more difficult than you yeah, thought? Yes, so you said you're attached. Oh, yeah. Like, rugs. That that was one thing she wanted. She wanted four rugs in the house. I'm like four rugs. Four rugs for me. I'm like mm-hmm. that's, that's a, a lot, lot of rugs. rugs. Yeah, I have way more than four rugs in yeah, my house. No, you need a. And a I'm finding that out. Yeah, you, you know. Need one right yeah. by your but bed I'm like, I don't want a budget for rugs. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I don't want a rug budget. Mm-hmm. But now that they're there and she's like picked them out, it's and great. They, yeah, isn't it so much? Mm-hmm. More, like living with a woman, right? It's like yeah. a game changer because women are just nice We're the best. to live with. Yeah. <laughs> it is nice to come home. I came home tonight briefly for five minutes. I she had, had to dinner? run out. She had dinner, yeah. Oh, that's oh so and cute. she saved it and put it aside for me. Oh. In, a, in a little Tupperware with a note. Yeah, it's oh. not. Yeah, <gasps> she no, she writes me notes in my lunch. Oh, that's <laughs> okay. This is nauseating. That's really cute. Danielle doesn't write you notes in your lunch. She used. I mean, first year marriage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ten years so in, when it's should, like when should Bradley uh, stop ex- stop expecting? Yeah, that? when did the notes quit? Uh yeah. Never stop. Around the second or third kid? Six years, maybe seven years. They say oh, every wow. seven years, that's when people mm. want another spouse. Th- no, then that's <laughs> when they rethink spouse. their life decisions. And But it's not just marriage. It's like any big decision. That's kind of like the road. So seven year se- itch. So when you're seven, seven years year old, itch. you're seven years old, you're like, you're like, man, what's your like, school? You're like, first grade sucks. Yeah. I'm, then 14. Well, okay, that's, that's accurate. Yeah. 14 was yeah, rough. Because you're. Then 27. 21. No, 21, <laughs> which a lot of decisions are happening then. True. Oh, wow. That is true. Then 28. That almost 30. 28 See, I, is like a very maturing like year. I still feel I think 20. 27 is a big year for mm, everybody. Really? I really feel like that. Mm. Well, that's, why, why, why? I don't know, because everybody I know has a weird year when they're 27. Hmm. Weird it's a weird number. In general. Is it a not, prime number? Is, it, is 27 a prime number? Yes. No. No. Yes. It's div- no. Divisible by nine and three. Damn it! You guys are good at math. <laughs> they do pay me for that. Speaking of marriage, I did hear someone say that when they he was talking about marriage things, and he said, you know, they say that two become one, but which one? Oh. You know, so it's like that's why you have to like you're like. Oh my, that's so I true. think like a, it's new not, a new yeah. one. A new one. It has well, to be. Well, it has to be a new one. Be, but hopefully. Like that's hopefully. the hardest part. Yeah. Yes. Is the you like, realize? Oh, I have to like let someone in on. That's what I of, think about because I've been single for so long. It's kind of like I'm a, set a, in my ways. It's kind of like a twin situation where one survives and one doesn't. <laughs> It's like well, wh- whoever's the stronger one. Well, only is that marriage? Survive. Yeah. But like compromise like is like so a which thing. Which one of you or Danielle survived? <laughs> well, that's the tough part. We're still trying to figure oh. that out. We're <laughs> Ten still in years the womb. In. We're still in the womb. We're still, still in the womb fighting for nutrients. Okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, it gets rough sometimes. Oh man. So. So that's a great. Okay. What other what uh, other lessons have you learned in your month and a half? Almost be two quiet. months. Ago? Two be months quiet. Be quiet. I just usually like I was used to living with my best friend. Like I've literally for the last ten years, I think I've lived with my best friends at least ten years, mm. and so I couldn't just say what I wanted to. You know, like sometimes I don't need to speak. Like if if my roommate before was like dirty and left something up there, I'd be like, I'd say something. Mm. But if I say something now that doesn't need to be said, it can start a fight because mm. we're that much closer. Yeah. Yeah. Forever. Yeah. And, and I'm like, she's like got her feelings hurt. Mm. Whereas yeah. like with your roommate, you're like, I don't care if I hurt your feelings. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Exactly. Yeah. It's good Stakes marriage. are higher. It definitely up, ups the intensity of everything because you're thinking I'm, I'm stuck with you. Like, <laughs> so like as you're I finding, panicked the first week. <laughs> yeah. Because really? it's I, like, this is panicked. not a chi- I can see. I can totally I panicked the that. first night. That's really? Such a, yeah. That's such a shift. It was like day three. That's such I, a mental I, shift. I like was on a uh, yeah, ski lift. High, sure. Ski lift. Yeah. No, I was on a ski and lift. You thought well, about you and I was not looking, a metaphorical no, ski lift like, of life. I was skiing, yeah. Okay. Oh, man. And I was like freaking out. I was like, oh, my gosh. And you're on like, a ski lift. 
thought about jumping off. This is off. the rest of my life. Yeah, I did, yeah. No, I didn't. Wait, what was your freak out about? So the first <laughs> night that we both were in a bed, like sleeping next, like mm-hmm. the first time I slept You're next like, to I a had woman. I to share a bed. No, so like. Love my so like it's, it's <laughs> a no 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 like that that all was fine it was like oh mm-hmm. this is, it's like a sleepover like mm-hmm. this is oh okay you know we're sleeping over and we were the we stayed in a cabin and the bed was like in the corner of the room and both walls were big massive windows and outside of the windows are just trees and it's in the middle of that's beautiful yeah it's in the that's middle awesome. of the woods near the lake but it's kind of creepy at night yeah. like it's super dark <laughs> yes. out the yeah. window yes. and so it's just like Texas night serial killers near the lake right mm-hmm. and so. Um, I'm having a hard time falling asleep. Danielle falls asleep really quickly. She's super tired. And then in the middle of the night, when I finally do fall asleep and I don't start falling asleep to like one in the morning or something, I'm just like, start like, okay, I'm, I'm starting to fall asleep and I fall asleep and Danielle shoots up, like fully (gasps) sits up and starts yelling. (gasps) Does she like, have night terrors? No, she just sits up and just goes, 902-422-79. And I sit oh up. Oh, my goodness. And I sit up and in like half asleep, I'm like grasping for a notepad to write down whatever she's. <laughs> and she's like, because she's like, she's like this saying. This must be important. She's like saying like, get the number. The number is this. And she's like saying all this. And, I, and then when I finally realize what happens, she lays back down. And then I'm just like. <laughs> Up. <laughs> and, I, and I'm just sitting For up the rest and, of your life. And I'm looking around and all I see is like dark forests, like dark woods. And are and you like, am I back. on a sitcom? Yeah. And the thing about the mind games that the Lord plays, it's kind of like thieving. Because when something like that happens and then goes away, like immediately afterwards, you're like, did that really did happen? That just happen? <laughs> so I was like, first thought was like, did that really happen? Mm-hmm. Second thought was like, does she do that every night? Yeah, <laughs> that's gonna be an issue. And so that was the panic moment where I was like, this might be a problem. <laughs> like, they didn't cover this in pregame. Yeah, okay. like, <laughs> I tell you she what, she did not disclose this information. <laughs> yes, was not. This would have been nice to know. Did she ever oh do that in the inventory? Uh, only. Or did she remember it in the morning? She didn't remember it. Oh no, no, yeah, she didn't remember it. She didn't remember doing it. Oh my gosh, at all. Wow. that's terrifying. Now she hasn't. I can't remember another time that she's done anything like that. She's maybe like like mumbled a little bit under yeah. her breath, but like sat full up, <laughs> that, was talking that's and scary, yeah, and like I would, moving would her arms terrifying. out and doing this, yeah. and, I, and I'm just like sitting up going, yeah, shouldn't have married her. <laughs> I'm just like sitting up going like every night, like you're like, can I return this one? I'm just, yeah, I'm just alone. Can I get another Saturday one? Warranty? Yeah, and I'm just alone. Like and then yeah. she sit, and then she lays back down. I'm just staring at her face like. I made this decision. Wow. <laughs> I love you so much, but I'm terrified of yeah, you right I was just now. Like, I was just like every night, huh? Yeah. Like, wow. Yeah. I have a friend who, um, like, has really bad insomnia, and when she married her husband, she was, I guess, just in this like dream life. You think like, well, once we get married, things. I'm not gonna be lonely anymore. I'm not mm-hmm. gonna be whatever, right? Mm-hmm. Well, they get married, and her husband falls right asleep <laughs> on their oh, honeymoon, man. and so she's up for hours, like dread you know thinking like oh my gosh like i'm still suffering from insomnia Mm. i feel alone i'm married to this man laying next to me Mm. but i still feel lonely and that's something i do think some single Mm -hmm. people think like oh once once i'm married like i won't be lonely anymore yes or like all my issues are gonna go away right like if anything they're gonna be amplified yeah am i right brought under a magnifying glass right Mm -hmm. like Mm -hmm. i heard you're right ali someone's gonna point it out to you preach aggressively preach it all right what what are you talking about maybe no. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. What were you gonna say, Bradley? You know, a priest said that one time. He said, "You know what? If no matter if you're a priest, religious life, single or married, you're gonna be lonely. You can't mm-hmm. avoid it." So, mm-hmm. yeah. I do think we had some comments on the last YouTube video that I wanted to. Uh, what was share. the last YouTube video? Or it, By Anna's episode. Yeah, our last oh. episode. Um, and then we had. Do we have comments. any current? Do we have any notes? In well, the, I, was I have one tell, note. I was oh, you had something you were gonna give me. I I don't think you're gonna like it in this <laughs> no. setting right now. Okay. Oh, oh, so I'll give it to you later. Um, I did want to tell the story of one of the best things that happened to me last week. <gasps> okay. So on oh, Saturday, <clears throat> is it Saturday? It was Saturday. I was hanging out at my house with some friends, just like a girls' pool day. And uh, well, I guess I should start the backstory of saying 
when we had the episode with Kyle without Edmund, Kyle and I went to several gas stations before to get, we had Dippin' Dots, if you guys remember. Oh. Um, but we were originally looking for SpongeBob ice cream with the gumball eyes. Mm -hmm. And I was really disappointed. We went to three different gas stations. They didn't have them. And so on Saturday, girls ate at the pool. All of a sudden we hear the ice cream man. Mm. And, and it still evokes yes, that like, yes. urgency. I need to run to yes. it. <laughs> and Gosh. so yep. my first thought was, I don't have any cash. <laughs> and one of my roommates said, I bet they take card. So I get out of the pool, <laughs> I go running suit. through the house in my swimsuit <laughs> barefoot, and I yell as I'm running in the back door to my roommate, where's your wallet? <laughs> because my wallet's in the car and I'm not gonna have time to get it. <laughs> so, die. and she says, it's the Auburn wallet on the counter. So I see it, grab it as I'm running, run, and I as I, as I run out my front door, I see and he's going down <gasps> and he's leaving. Oh no. And I said, wait! <laughs> Are you still in your swimsuit? Yes. False. Did not have time to change. So I yell. He doesn't hear me. Oh, my god. So gosh. I take off running oh my god. down the driveway, <laughs> around the corner. I'm running <laughs> down the street to the ice cream man, yelling, like waving my arms, like, stop. Yes. He sees me. He puts it in reverse. Put it in reverse. Put it in reverse. I'm an ice cream man. I run up. Did right? his duty. Did his duty. <laughs> Yes, that, day. that was not an ice cream boy. That was an ice that cream man. That was an ice man. cream man. <laughs> so I run up. They have all the cartoon oh. characters. So I have my roommate's wallet with me. And I'm like, how much money is in here? I open it up. There's, there's just one credit card. And by this time, she's chasing after me. I'm like, how much can I spend on this? <laughs> What is your limit, sir? <laughs> I'll take the lot. <laughs> so I get like, I get like some Tweety Birds with gumball Ooh, eyes. Yes. Some SpongeBob with gumball yep. eyes. Some yeah. Spider Mans, which yes. don't have gumball eyes. But Spider Mans. Okay. Spider Man. Spider Man. Got some Spider, Spider Man. Man. Uh, I got Sonic the Hedgehog. We got some of those strawberry shortcake ones. I we really, were about. I do not I know the last that. time I went to an ice cream shop. Honestly, it was it made I think come my, in my day. anymore. Day that's like, amazing. I was those SpongeBob ice creams taste so good. I don't even. I can't even picture in my head oh, what it, it tastes so great. like. Really? It was. It was. I can't even. <laughs> Try. I have no. I have no. I can't even it tastes like fruit punch. No palate oh reference. Oh, you just picture in your head. I have no palate reference. Just I'll picture bring in you one because I bought eleven. I think Allie actually her energy is kind of ice cream man's with gumballs. <laughs> what does that mean? No, no, you just have Gumball the energy eyes. of an ice cream truck driver. I Well, that's a dream job. Do you job. know how much joy you yeah. bring as an ice also, cream? Also, no, I don't. Do you see <laughs> did me. you see her face light yeah. up? Did you see me? Did you well, see that? I don't know that I want to light her face she up. Maybe kids. <laughs> okay, also that's another thing is as I was running, I was I was just imagining all my neighbors like coming seeing out. This. No, no, no. Just oh. watching from their living rooms. <laughs> a and grown seeing ass girl a running A 31-year-old woman in her an it. American flag, <laughs> st stars on top, stripes on bottom, <laughs> running, running down after. the street barefoot. Kid, the, the number of kids around? Yes. Zero. Oh, I see. In my head, I imagine what a moment for the neighborhood unity to like all pile out of their house and and, and cheer and for this woman. And you're the leader <laughs> and you're like the Pied Piper that is leading but them to glory. Happen. Yeah, but that no, didn't everyone, happen. No, everyone closed their door the and locked it. It's just Brittany it. just running <laughs> and yelling by herself. <laughs> Barely closed. Dude, that ice cream truck might have the pedal no, all the way was, down. <laughs> He was like, <laughs> it's like a golf cart. It can only go 30. This one go any faster. He's like, 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 he's I don't know, you just have the energy of like a super positive, like, hi, here's your ice cream man. Who doesn't well, if you're too positive as an ice cream man, it's creepy. Yeah, <laughs> you, yeah, but, but, be, but that's my point. Be, when you're too positive, appropriately positive, very creepy. When Allie's too positive, <laughs> mildly annoying. Like, that's the worst. You're too positive, creepy. You, it's like mildly. If I'm ever too positive, you're like, 
Are you gonna what? kill me? Are you gonna murder me? <laughs> Why are you so happy to take yeah, that? Are money? you gonna wear my skin bag? <laughs> oh my like gosh. turn it into a vase or something, like, or, a, or like a lamp? Wait, you think I'm mildly annoying? No, no, I'm saying like the <laughs> worst. No, I'm that. saying the worst that could happen if you're too he positive. He thinks I want to wear his skin, so yeah. Not I'm good saying things. if you're too positive <laughs> uh-huh. toward one of my children, and mm-hmm. you're the ice cream man's, mm-hmm. and man. and and a kid, and I'm like, and you're too positive. Uh-huh. I'm just like, oh, that's a little okay. I won't give you. She's too positive. I'm like. Let's go. <laughs> like, give him the, give her the Spider Man back. Throw it to us. Yeah, and the, and then I say, I'm calling HOA. Yeah, <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> no soliciting. Does HOA have a have a decision of whether the ice cream? I don't can know. Maybe. Can I don't know. But now, like I, now I now I have his name because his name showed up on the credit card. So I'm gonna find him on social media and tell him to come back. Is that like a food truck where you can awesome. tell him to come back? I don't you know. can I tell food trucks to come back. Media. Well, like you can coordinate for a food truck to like show up at a place and then. Oh, like, gotcha. Yeah, the Kona I, ice uh, truck came to our block party in Allie, my neighborhood. Oh, I wanna. I what wanna would your ice cream, cream truck? Cream, I don't know. What would it be called? I don't know. Allie's ice. Allie's ice. Uh, ice ice Allie. Allie's cream. Uh, Allie's. I literally just thought that. Ice in my head. ice. Oh my gosh. Ice ice Maybe Allie. Maybe that's, that's, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's okay. Amazing. And then um, did we also just start a band? Okay, okay, okay. I think okay, so. Okay. Can you have all the characters? Wait, wait, wait. But everyone. Ones I like. So everyone, everyone, listen. Like, close your eyes. Okay. And now. Just hear out. Al- Allie's gonna. You're Allie's, gonna pitch it. No, no, no. Allie's gonna sing. Ice, ice. The, no, the ice cream truck jingle of her ice cream truck. Oh, it is. no, it's the so same it's coming, jingle no matter shut what. Shut up! It's her truck. No, it's the same jingle. You don't get to pick the jingle. Because Allie's gonna pick. Allie, are you gonna pick your jingle or not? Well, I would have two. <laughs> See? Okay. Do you want me to okay. sing? No, no, I'll no. sing the first one because I know it. Yeah, yeah. She knows, this, it. and then I'll sing mine. Yes. Okay, you fine. are so mean to yes. me. But why yes. not let her do her thing? No, no, I know mine. Okay, I know what I do would it. do. But do she it. would. You're so mean. But this one evokes okay, people getting is, out of their of their pool the, to I'm run to barefoot. Sing, what I'm about to sing is the official Ice Cream Man song. Okay. And then I'll do okay. mine. Do you need, the, fir- do you need mine. the first note? No. <laughs> There yeah. was a little chicky. Wait, what no, you're, wait, no, 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 no. I thought it was you're just singing jingle. Actual, wow. Like the lyrics? There's lyrics yes. to it? Yes. Oh, I'm I about thought to... you were just going to go. Boop, 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 boop. I thought you were going to do that. <laughs> no. I didn't know there was actually words. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to sing them for you. Okay. Okay. Right, okay. 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 I, I didn't know there was lyrics. This is why you're so mean. No, okay, I here just, we go. Okay, okay do okay. it. There was a little chicky and he wouldn't lay an egg, so I poured hot water up and <gasps> down his leg. I can Well, the little chicky squawked and the little chicky begged and the little chicky laid me a hard boiled egg. Wait, so can you yes, run the wow. lyrics by me again? There was a little chicky. Okay. He wouldn't lay an egg. <laughs> so I poured hot water. Oh my gosh. Up and down his leg. Ooh. The little chicky squawked. <laughs> and the little chicky begged. Ooh. And the little chicky laid me a hard boiled egg. Didn't know those this were the lyrics. This is a creepy song. But I totally am there. I am chasing yes. that, okay. that truck. Uh, right. Allie, now, what are Allie, your you lyrics going to okay. be? Okay, close your eyes. All right. It's should I do the lyrics or should I do the jingle? Like the just the I think lyrics. it's up to you. Brittany definitely okay. took it up a level. Okay. Yeah. So if you just go boop a doop a doop. Like, okay, I'll have, have lyrics. Okay. I have lyrics. Boop, boop, okay, ready? Mm-hmm. You put my love on top, baby. Because you're the one that I want. <laughs> baby, you're the one that I need. You're the only one I see. Come on, baby, it's you. You're the one that gives your all. One the sun fall. Something in sin is stop. Finally, you put my love on top, baby. Cause you're the one that I love. <laughs> baby, you're the one that I need. You're the only one I need. See, we have four more key changes, yeah, so keep buckle going, up. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. You, <laughs> you're the one that gives your all. You're the one I always call. When I need you, make everyone stop. Finally, you put my love on top, baby. Cause you're the one that I want. Baby, you're the one that I need. You're the only one I see. Come on, baby, it's right. you. Okay. You're the one that gives your all. Okay. You're the one I can always call. Right. What I need to make yeah. everything stop. Yeah. Finally, yeah. you put uh, my love uh, on top, uh, uh, baby. Cause you're the one that I want. Okay. Yeah, okay. 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 so okay. You're the one I need. You're the only one I see. Come on, baby, it's you. You're the one that gives your all. The thing is, the thing is, 
<laughs> my jingle is gonna be <laughs> that so exact good. recording. Okay. Uh, just played throughout. So it's so not. So how do you loop? It just goes back. I just loop it no, and so, I start so, low. So can you show us? You're a musician, you know. Can you show us how it loops? You know key changes. I do. Yeah, I love it. Can you show us how it loops from the top to the bottom? Yeah. Um, what was the starting yeah. off? Yeah. Baby, you're the, you're the one that I love. Okay. Baby, you're the okay. so full circle. So good. Okay. Adrian, if we could cut that great. and I could have that as my own personal recording, that'd be really great. So just like so, so you're the ice like cream man. that. So you're the ice woman. cream man. You're the ice cream man. I'm the ice cream woman. Mans. And we and so like we Multiple. show up and we're like, oh hey, uh, that was a cool Baby. jingle. Oh, you want some Beyonce what ice? <laughs> That's what I would say. Some Jay Z. What is Beyonce ice? Some Jay Z. Pops? Pops. Jay-Z you want Pops. some blue Carter, blue Ivy? This seems like a young adult. Freezer things? Like, no. Ooh, like is there alcohol in work. your ice cream? Oh. <gasps> what? What'd you say? There's Boozy. alcohol in her ice cream. I would have traditional. Okay, a boozy OGs. ice cream truck yep. would be And then I would, would have awesome. a boozy ice cream truck. Something for the something for dad. The adult milkshakes. Edmund. Like I'm, the tagline Edmund? is something for your kid and something for right. dad. <laughs> Why not mom? Or something know. for parents. I don't know. It doesn't Something for adults. I mean that. Mm. The ice cream truck for your for, kids. Not everyone and identifies adults. as a mom or a dad. Okay, well, birthing people, people who birth. <laughs> adults. Yeah, adult, uh, ice cream truck shopping. now for adults now, too. Can, now ooh, serving adults. Oh, we'll, we'll take the ice cream truck through a bummer and lazar strategy set. Yes. Okay. Also, I mean, I'm quoting the studio. I have a new passion in life. <laughs> I, you know what? If you do that, I think I'll invest. I think I'll be a partner. So you anyway. can park the ice cream truck right outside the studio. <gasps> yeah. And then that's next to Adrian's coffee cart. Oh my yeah. gosh, yes, because Adrian wants to do a coffee cart. Adrian, I'm done. Okay, let's do if it. You get oh, enough, and then y'all can combine, if you get and you can get coffee on an ice cream, an oh. affogato. An affogato. An affogato. Yeah. Didn't know that's what it was called. It's an affogato. Yeah. It's, it's, it's coffee on top of ice cream. It's espresso on affogato. Mm-hmm. ice cream. Mm-hmm. That sounds Speaking amazing. Of music. Mm-hmm. I did want to share something. Let's it's an it. Instagram. Now you might be thinking, is this someone singing? There are multiple people singing, but you don't see it. It's not, he's not bearded. Okay. Adrian, could you please pull up the show notes? We won't be able to hear it though. Oh no. Oh, you have to hear it. That's the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe we have to wait. We'll have to wait till we have headphones. Well, the anticipation is building. (laughs) (sighs) Tune in next time to see my game. (laughs) It's a game. It is a game. What did you want to give me? I just don't think you're in the right headspace to receive it right what now. What headspace would I need? Hey, a control hey, headspace? Hey, 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 Maybe. Okay, wait. Let me get Okay. Well, that's making me less receptive. <laughs> just like it made me like let's wait on a scale of one to ten, receptive right now is like uh-huh. an eight. But Brittany, do that again. Okay. The little twitch. Uh, yeah, I'm like. Five. Not yeah. Six, I'm, seven, da- I'm really down. Okay. I'm, yeah. Okay. Bring it back up. Your hands are kind of okay. Coming back. Okay. Eight. Eight. How can we get it to a ten? <sighs> Edmund. No. Here's the I thing. know. What? Go. I was just gonna say I did work hard on this. Oh no! Did you give me a gift? I we made love you a lot. You. Oh no! And we admire you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is this a joke? Is this no, a no, bit? no, it's no. This is not a bit. It's really not for real. This is not a bit. It's I worked hard on this. She did. And I thought that it would be something we she could really, hang in She really she texted me. She's like, "Do you think he would?" I was like, "I definitely think yes. so." It's a piece of art for the oh. studio. Sort of. Is it the Declaration of Independence but Close. No, hand-lettered? but even Close. better. The Star Spangled Banner? No. It is. That's upside It's upside down. down. Shoot. It is Pope Paul VI letter to artists. Oh, oh this is very that cool. I hand wrote. Hand um that, so know, most right? people know about John Paul II's letter to artists, yeah. which is very long. But Pope Paul VI was the OG who wrote letters to a letter to artists. I thought mm-hmm. it was Pope Paul. I thought Pope John Paul II also wrote a letter. Yeah, but he was after Pope Paul. So VI. this is like the OG one. Yeah, yes. yeah, exactly. Oh wow! Yes. So I this lettered all of your artistic endeavors, and I think it's a cool thing for us it to like hang cool. up in the studio somewhere. They sell studios or they, they sell uh, frames. I mean, look at that. They sell yeah, affordable awesome. frames at frames That's at Walgreens. I did not get that far. No, I'm saying like I could on my way home and buy it. Or my way here, I could buy a frame. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Yeah, you're that was welcome. very sweet. Let's read it all together. It's actually really we good. Now, I'm just kidding. I'm In totally the name kidding. of the Father. It's <laughs> relatively short, but the bold, the bold things you could read. Yeah. What made you? What made the you church decide needs what? you and turns to you as artists. You are the guardians of the beauty in the world. It reminds me of the Guardians of the Galaxy. It's kind of like <laughs> Lord Star, Star Lord. The Guardians of the what? 
Guardians of Beauty in the World. Whoa. Guardians of Beauty. Mm. Guardians of Beauty. Do we just start a band name? That's yeah. amazing. Is that a good band name? It's a great band name. Guardians of Beauty. So anyway. <clears throat> I think well, that's you. beautiful. It's Where awesome. should we hang it? I actually was thinking, and this is why I didn't get a frame, is because I think it would look kind of cool to just literally tape it up. Mm. Um, I was thinking sort of like Martin Avant Luther, theses oh, on the door. Yeah, you could nail it to, yeah. to the door. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> I was thinking, because it's really kind of like marching orders for Mm -hmm. artists. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And like that's who comes in and out of our doors all the time. So it's like, that would be kind of cool. Or you can hang it above the toilet. I knew you were going to (laughs) want to put it in the bathroom. (laughs) Well, I just think a lot. I don't. But but when we go use the restroom, we don't face the back like Mm -hmm. you. You know where this would fit perfectly is in the frame of the The autograph signed uh, Michael (laughs) Voris. I know. Paper I thing. just I never thought about that. Okay, so in, when guys use the bathroom in public, they have advertisements like in front of the urinals or yeah. newspapers. Do they or, do that for girls? No. Well, on the they're on the other wall. Are they on the other no, but that's what but I'm saying. They, they, but they do. Yeah. yeah. Do they yeah, really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, lots oh, of advertisements. Wow. Yeah. I never Link thought about Rachel's that. Vineyard. Yep. Mm-hmm. And like, and, but at sitting level. Yeah. Oh, uh, it's kind of high. Um, let me, let me imagine. Yeah, imagine you're peeing. Yeah, imagine you're sitting on the toilet. Imagine you're peeing. Yeah, it's probably like this level so that when you do stand up, it's, like a, it's not like face still to low. Face, yeah. yeah, face to face. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But there's a lot There's a lot of advertisements, so it could have multiple sheets Yeah, you can have a whole... Mm, <laughs> a yeah. Wallpaper, plethora. I don't know That's why, amazing. but it does remind me of uh, the reel. I do want to mention this reel that I just want to mention. Are you allowed to talk about it? Yeah. Ask me if I'm allowed to talk about it. I just did. Ask me again. Are you, you allowed wanna... to talk about it? Depends on what you're talking about. <laughs> Did you sign an NDA for this reel? Who's asking? I am. <laughs> Allie, Hoffman Allie Hoffman right now. <laughs> I, Allie Hoffman. No, oh I posted gosh. I posted this uh reel of uh my daughter. So oh, yes. we went oh, yeah. to um Good Shepherd. You did talk about this on the podcast. No, already. I did not. Oh, really? Oh, we talked about it. Oh, maybe we did. Well, on the episode yeah. that you weren't there. Oh, my daughter right. started uh, we couldn't stop her. She tried a few times to do this, and we kept like pulling her back until finally we were like, whatever. And it's a confession line. She was going up and down the confession line, not just giving a thumbs up, but she has this like funny face she does, and it's not like I'm trying to be funny. She'll just go. <laughs> yeah, that's literally what she's doing. It's so cute. <laughs> and so she was just like making eye contact with everyone. I like, so wish I was in that line. So like, you know? she's like normal face, just like thumbs up, and then she's like. <laughs> <laughs> she, I guess she thinks it's funny or something, and then Aww. she was just walking up and down the line, and she would like do it until they did it back. She would like make yeah, she stopped and she like goes aggressively. Yeah. <laughs> and then at one point she's shooting it at yeah. them. Yeah, <laughs> so cute. Uh, when she first she walked into the main sanctuary mm-hmm. and walked up and down the line, I guess she was just kind of thinking about I don't know something about the everyone lined up. She just starts walking down the line, looking at all of them, and she starts putting her hands on her hips and just kind of looking at everybody. <laughs> and then she she's starts like, walking. Yes, sinners. Yeah, she's like, like look at, at this. <laughs> and she's making the face. And then at some point she starts thumbs up. And then people That's start hilarious. thumbing up. And I was like, please don't thumb back at her. Thumb up I would her. double. Don't, I would double thumb like, so hard encourage back. encourage her. I would follow her. <laughs> she just kept. And it's not like she's smiling like, hey, thumbs up. It's she's like, a leader. <laughs> I would totally follow her. That's amazing. The confession. It's, I love that. I yeah. mean, the whole situation would have been very different if she... Yeah, <laughs> that's true. No, that would have been another like, yes, sinner. You are a sinner. If she just walked up and down the line. Yeah. Was like, or like her middle finger or something. You know, that would have been. Like, yeah, that would have been very different vibes. <laughs> very different vibes. Yeah, it yeah. was so. Yeah, follow Edmund adorable. Mitchell. Look at his reel. It's pretty it's cute. Very cute. Awesome. Uh, very adorable. Is that bad that I posted it on Instagram and no. now it's going viral? No. Well, I did have this moment where I was like, "What if she becomes a meme?" And then for the rest of her uh, life, she's, she's like, the uh, thumbs, thumbs, up. thumbs up confession girl. Thumbs awesome. Up confession girl. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's who make wants, it go viral. Who wants to marry thumbs up confession girl? A lot of people will probably want to marry her. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, she becomes a nun. Okay. You know. She's she looks nun. just like Danielle in that. She does. So when cute. you're when you're yeah, she started wearing dresses. That's yeah. like a whole issue yeah. now. Aww. Oh no. She just looks too old. <laughs> so cute. How old is she now? I don't know. Three. Oh. <laughs> she turned three in March, I think. <laughs> I never know. <laughs> you know what's you know the bad part is, so once you memorize all of their ages, then one of them changes. Yeah, uh-huh. that's true. That's that, that's that is a problem. Well, yeah, but so what's your excuse for not memorizing their names? Because their names don't change. Their middle names do kind of they don't change, you're right. <laughs> 
<laughs> you tried to explain it out. You're like, well, but technically the middle name, and then you do it. No, they don't change yeah, it all. No, the middle names are tough. I do know their first names pretty much. Oh, okay. <laughs> Usually. Yeah. Well, I did sit five. next to Dominic at mass on Sunday. Yeah. It was great. Did he? Was he? Did he behave? He was perfect. An angel. We had a little bit of anxiety about Elijah. Like right after we named him, our next door neighbor was pr- kept pronouncing it differently. How? Elijah. Oh. And we she were never like, read the Bible. Elijah. No, it was a ex pastor. Oh, oh wow. Oh. It was like oh, I'll, we were like oh, so they read the he, Bible. And and like we did this thing where and he was like an older gentleman, but he was like so what's his name? And I and we said Elijah, and he said oh. Uh, Alicia. No. And we were like, no, 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 Elijah. Uh, or no, we were, this Elijah. is what we kept doing. It was like, wait, Elijah. And, and Elijah. he was saying, oh, Elijah. And we were like, no, 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 Elijah. Like, Elijah. No, it's Elijah. 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 And he was like, oh, Elijah. how do you spell it? And we said E E L I J A H. Is that how you spell it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's my son. Uh, <laughs> it's my son. And he was like, oh, Elijah. Ja, or how does the wrong anyway Elijah Elijah he kept saying Elijah and we were like, like no. shoot did we name him the wrong one or something oh, oh yeah. we were like, are we pronouncing it wrong because yeah. we didn't say it to anyone we just my wife and I just yeah. like, okay picked one and we kept saying it yeah but then the Elijah. first person well not the first person but like a person who should know like was like a pastor mm-hmm. was like so Alicia or Elijah Elijah. Oh my and we were gosh. like, crap. Eli. Oops. Yeah, yeah. that's so. Oh. Elijah. Elijah. For the record, it's Elijah. 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 Yeah. Elijah. It's Elijah. 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 It's your so. French Canadian coming out. <laughs> Adrian, is there anything else we got, ma'am? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Adrian's ready to go. Bradley, Adrian where? doesn't have a microphone, so he's like, oh. Bradley, thanks for coming. You're welcome on the show thanks, anytime. Yeah. Where can people go to support you? Spotify? Uh, Yeah, go to Spotify. Find Just my put music. your music on Bradley yeah. Banning. Bradley Banning. Go see him in shows. Yeah. Great yeah. Where are you playing next? Oh, Deep Elm tomorrow. Deep Elm Brewing Company. Go to Deep Elm nice. tomorrow. Yeah. Well, but this comes they out next even, Tuesday. Oh, yeah. Where are you playing next, next week? week? Next Wednesday. I don't know. Or beyond. Go to BradleyBanning.com. Oh, go to BradleyBanning.com. The whole schedule is the there. Thing Fun is, there. All of my Wednesdays are now booked because of the Loki series on Disney Plus, which I oh, nice. really enjoyed. Have you Bradley's guys all watched it? Have you guys all watched it's it? Live. No, I haven't. <sighs> I just, no, but your kids good? were actually telling me about about it, and they were very disappointed when I asked them, is that Star Wars? <laughs> and they yeah, said, that's very oh. no, Brittany. Oh, it was amazing. The third episode, um, Adrian, the third episode. I haven't the seen last, any of it yet. The last scene of Are the third episode, it? I was like, yeah. this is like I love movie Marvel. quality. Really? It's like oh, the yeah. craziest. It's a single continuous camera with obviously tons of green screens, but also tons of people. And it just like goes in and out of <gasps> buildings and like one Wait, continuous the whole series? Shot. No, just like this this l- final scene, scene which gotcha. it's like five minutes or something, Adrian. It's, it's a long one. It's like a five minute, con- it looks like a continuous camera sequence with like, Things are blowing up. Things are happening. Fight sequence. They're inside a building, then outside a building. But the camera's just following. <gasps> it's crazy. My parents and I, we've we've done the Marvel marathon where it's like all of the movies in the in order, and we just did it again, and we just did Infinity War. So we have Endgame, it's and so then good. we already watched Wandavision, so we won't do that. But did you guys like we'll Wandavision? Loki. Oh yeah, I loved it. Okay, it was good. I loved Wandavision. Yeah, yeah. I really did. I'm so- so sad. Did you watch the Winter Soldier, Winter Falcon no, thing? We haven't done. We haven't done any good. of the shows. Just Wandavision. Oh, okay. So, Loki is worth watching. Loki, Loki's worth watching. What was that? Say it. Loki, low, low key. <laughs> Loki's worth watching. I see what you did there. Get on my level. I don't understand what she's oh saying. Oh my gosh, Loki. Loki. Yes. Loki's worth watching. Why are you saying? Let me say it one more time. Okay. Loki. Loki's worth watching. Oh my gosh. Low key. Oh, Low like, key's worth okay. watching. Oh my gosh. That is very wow. dumb. That's very... I got it. <laughs> did you? Um, did you? I did. I did it. So. What's it like to be so watch, dumb? Definitely watch Loki. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm very excited because we're, yeah, really we're about good. to end game. I'm sorry. It's we'll really get good, to it. Though. My dad really gets dumb. in town, back in town. It's podcast personality. Yeah. And then. Loki. Loki. Okay. Every time we've watched it, our kids always go, wait, what? It's over? That was so short. And I was like, mm. that was a 48 minute wow. like, oh, episode. Wow. I love those guys. Oh, yeah. Okay, that makes They're very, excited. very good. Cool. Okay. Loki Great. and uh, who's the guy with the broken nose? Uh, what? Owen Wilson. Is He's it? in it? He's what? very good. He's in it. Yeah. Wow. A little okay. spoiler alert for oh. you. Okay, don't His spoil nose, anything else. 
is still healed? broken. Oh, okay. <laughs> it actually looks worse. That. Oh, no. In some of the scenes, I was like, man, they broke it more for this <laughs> for the episode. No, he had no, broken noses. He's got like an S. Like a oh, he's got a lot of stuff yeah. going on. Yeah. yeah, he's got a whole spaghetti strand. <laughs> like, yeah, it's rough. Owen Wilson, if you're watching this, we do, if you would like to you're sponsor fine. the show. Yeah, he's you got can, spaghetti junction. Your nose yeah. is fine. Yeah, no, junction. it's not. It's, everyone has a nose, and yours is fine. Junction. All right, guys, thanks, Riley, for being on the show. Woo! Thank you. Allie and Brittany, you're welcome back next week. <laughs> wow. <laughs> thanks, Adrian. Play us out. Thanks, Woo! everyone, for watching. Please Woo! comment below. Subscribe. We'll go to Patreon. Go to the Patreon. Studio Coffee. Give Support us YouTube us. comments. Bye. 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 Give us comments on YouTube. Uh, Instagram. Good job, team. Man, I'm glad to hear you all so much stuff going. That's awesome. And I didn't know about this one. Three, two, one. I didn't know there was another one.